The topic of the session is trigonometry. What is trigonometry in mathematics? What is trigonometry? Trigonometry has been derived from three different words trigonometry. The trigonometry has trigonometry. Now, tri is three, which is a three sided figure which is a triangle. We know that a three sided figure is a triangle and gono is angle and metri is measure. So with these three basic words split out of trigonometry have their own individual meanings. Tri is three, gono is angle and metri is measure. Measure of three angles of a triangle is called trigonometry. So trigonometry split as trigonometry is measure of three sides or measure of three angles of a triangle is called trigonometry. In general, what is the purpose of trigonometry? Why did mathematicians effort in researching on identifying the topic of trigonometry? What was the need for mathematics or the branch of mathematics to come out with the purpose or the reason for identifying this topic and its significance in daily life? Is the biggest question out here the purpose or the need for trigonometry imagine let's come out with a small activity to understand why trigonometry is very important in daily life say for example imagine I go into the deep forest and then I, I, I just come into a place where I have a small lake bed where all water is flowing in the lake bed So here is the lake bed and here is all the forest complete and even the other side there is the forest out there. So I was going on a trekking on my trip and then I just came till here and I was halting to know how I can cross to the other side of the small lake bed or the river flowing canal to go to the other side of the forest. So I was puzzled on... I'd, Imagining that I can do that if I put some wooden log out here and then this wooden log on which I'm going to crawl or walk carefully to go to the other side. To do this, mathematically, I paused for a while to imagine how much of the wood or the log of wood I can put on this canal bed to go to the other side. I wanted to estimate the length of the wood log I need to put on the river flowing small canal. So this puzzled me because I couldn't exactly measure the length of the, the width of the canal or the width of the river flowing there by just measuring with a tape because I cannot do that manually because for a while I don't have the log here. So how do I find the length, the width of this using the mathematics or the branch of mathematics is the biggest question when I go and stand at the bank of the river this side. So these kind of questions are were big puzzles in identifying how we can successfully go to the other side of the forest. This can be done and this is strictly possible if we know the topic of trigonometry. Trigonometry helps us in estimating this distance without actually measuring it. The power of trigonometry is to measure these distances without actually measuring with tape. Imagine I have a long tower, say it is a Qutub Minar. I have a Qutub Minar here. And then I stand here. I just stand here. And then I want to find the height of the Qutub Minar by just standing out here, which is just 5 meters away from here. Or 15 meters away from here then how do I find the height of the Qutub Minar without actually measuring with tape it is possible using the topic of trigonometry trigonometry is how we introduce the concept of trigonometry which solves many problems like finding the height of the Qutub Minar or crossing the length of the river onto the other side by crossing to the other side of the forest by just estimating the width of the river. So all these real life puzzles or tasks 
can be overcome if we know the concept of trigonometry applied in real life.